far as tabs go. Um, these could these could have easily been tabs. I'll show you how to make the tabs real quick. Go into the component that you want to edit. In this case, it's this one. I'm just going to draw a flat line across here instead of anything else. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Make sure we delete it. Yep. Go into this one component. Draw a flat line here. Get rid of these. All right. If we wanted to connect these in a different way, the tab, the locking tab method. What I do, again, is I draw the intersecting line. When it turns black, you know it's where two parts are intersecting. Go right down the the middle of that part and here's the way I work it. I go up an eighth because you know half that's half a quarter and you're I'm working with a quarter inch foam usually mainly. And we have an eighth inch there. I go from here down an eighth. It'll show you your eighths there. I mean your measurements there. They're still in the parallel thing there. All right. This is basically as a guide. So uh, usually let's go in an inch. And then we'll go up, and we'll, we're working on our tabs, so let's make our tabs an inch wide also, or a half inch. Let's make them a half inch. There. Now that could be our first tab. It's an eighth here, and it's an eighth here. It gives us a quarter inch. At this point, we can get rid of this. When it deletes like that, sometimes you have to redraw, retrace the lines, and it'll come back. Now that's, let's see, that's a, yep. We can get rid of this. And you can see it start to look like, look like a tab. We could select that if we wanted to. And hold down control with our move tool. Put it anywhere we want. Oops. Put another one up here. I don't know why it adds his other lines, but I just reselect it, hit control again, and do another one. And let's see, these are gonna be our top tabs, so we have to look at it. You have to visualize that this foam is, I mean, that this is a quarter inch thick piece of foam here, and this is quarter inch thick this way too, so you have to be thinking about that. Let's get rid of these lines. But it, it's second nature after a while, it just gets really easy to use. Now these, the underneath part, we know these two tabs can't line up. So, I'll select this. You can move this over right next to it if you want it to, which is what I usually do. Get rid of this. Oops. Not that one, this one. Okay. Put another one it's right here, and there, and one more there. I'm trying to do this really quick. Normally, you know, I'd find the center and try to do it that way.
make it nice and even and split all the differences and all that, but you know how much space video can take up. So I'm trying to get it done. But, um, let's see. You have to kind of visualize where these tabs would be. Whoops, that was a mistake. That needs to be. Wait a minute, that's a mistake too. The ones that are side by side really mess me up. But we know this is the bottom one, right? Yeah. This is a bottom one, this is a bottom one. The top one, top one, bottom one. You can start seeing this is a bottom one, this is a top one. This is a bottom one. This is the top one because the foam is going to come down and lock in this way. This foam is going to come up and lock in this way into this piece eventually. So looking at this, this is going to come up from the bottom. This one we want to come up from the bottom too, so it's going to be like that. We knew this back one was going to come down, so that's where we messed up earlier. All right. At this point, let's select this with two clicks. It selects all the uh, the touching vectors. Now, if I select it three times, it's going to select everything, which we don't want. So, a couple clicks, and what you want to do is just copy that, and then hit delete. Oh no, it deleted everything. But that's all right. Oh wait a minute, that's not all right deleted that too, we didn't want that, because these were touching. Copy that, and we want to keep those in there, so delete that. There. Now we have that copied into the uh, clipboard memory, so let's just work on this one for a while while that's hidden. Just connect these tabs. Let's see, we're missing something. Something's open somewhere. So that should have turned into a face. Aha, uh -huh. right here. And that was where one of the uh, bottom tabs came up. Oh, there's another one. There. Okay, now that one's ready to go. Let's uh click out of here in the gray somewhere, and let's hit uh, paste. Oops. Now where did that go? There it is. Two of them. Oops. Double click that. Yeah, if you lose a part or you get lost in something, just click this zoom extends. No matter what's on the board, it'll zoom to all of it. 